Hi, my name's Chris, and I had my first dolphin treatment about uh, two weeks ago or so, a little less than two weeks. Long history, I guess. I've been racing and riding bikes for probably 30 plus years since I was probably around 20. So I'm 53 now, so 23 years plus. And had a few crashes. Uh, I've had a few concussions, uh, two or three concussions through my whole history, I guess. Um, a bad accident in 97, a clinical break in my neck, landed on the top of my head, and I was out of commission for basically four or five months, got back, and raced for another four or five years, and then retired when I was about 32. Um, through that time, <clears throat> I've continued to ride, uh, ski, things like that. Had a few crashes here and there, um, but to fast forward to uh, a few hits, uh, two years ago, I took a hit and had a slight concussion out west riding when I hit my shoulder in the side of my face. Um, I was out for about a minute and then I came back to and then continued on and uh, recovered from that. Um, a year ago, taking me back just to last Christmas, I received um, a diagnosis I had COVID. And Prior to that, I had had RSV and it turned to pneumonia. So for the last year, I've been struggling trying to get my life back because of this. So taking me back now through the year, as I tried to get back into my life, I decided that I was going to try to do more and it didn't work out. I actually came back maybe too soon and I started getting weaker, uh, slurring in my speech. My memory problems have not gone away or any better now. Um, when I get tired, I do affect myself even more because I get even more sore, more cognitive issues happening and been struggling with that. And this past October, I fell down the stairs and did a full front flip, land on the back of my head, strained all the left side of my body, my shoulder, my erector muscles, hit the back of my head and they diagnosed me with a concussion. Um, I've had multiple MRIs, nothing showing that other than swelling um, from the concussion stuff, maybe from the past, who knows, but from having long COVID. And that's where they've been trying to f figure out things. They do not have answers. They just know that I have it and time is supposed to heal. <laughs> and which has brought me to this because this is where I really feel the answers are. And let's find out what's causing this, all right? Whatever releases that is, is causing your problems. Because okay. the Lyme is very much cognitive and mm -hmm. it's very much the head. Yeah. So there's something in the body that's affecting the head. So let's figure it out. So, and generally try to go back. I don't see any major birthmarks, but I do see a couple little ones here, there, um, but nothing serious. Mm -mm. Now, look how much different that is. That a huge difference. The treatment was incredible, actually. It was tremendous changes I feel already uh, with range of motion in my neck. Um, even some spots where I know I was sore, that soreness is actually gone right now. Um, feel a little tired. And I had a little bit of an elevation of uh, some stuff in my nasal passage. But we did a lot of stuff in my head today, so, um, and did some, some work on my sphenoid bone in behind the nose. And I can feel that there's a lot of release in there. Um, peripherally, I feel a little tingly, my, my, my feet and my hands. So I had a lot of nerve responses today, a lot of referrals. Um, so incredible treatment and uh, I'm very happy. First, first treatment was a great success, um, a very much uh, unraveling of the issues that I have been dealing with for a very long time. Um, having COVID, long COVID for a year now. And through that time about three and a half months ago, fell down the stairs and received a very serious concussion and whiplash in my neck, in my mid-back, lower back, 
And through the treatment, the first one with Dr. Bruce, it was amazing how the headaches subsided dramatically um, and more relaxed and unraveled through the shoulder and, and back into the hips. And it was, a, it was a huge success and a good starting point to move forward with all the stuff that he has given me since then to, to do on different parts of my body to bring down the sympathetic nervous response that I could not get out of because of having long COVID and uh, causing me many, many problems for a lot of, a long time, like a whole year. And uh, it's the first time that I'm feeling some hope and some success.